What's up, BDU? So it's old Big C. It's about 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. Can you sleep? Give you three guesses who uh, who keep me up. But, uh, but anyway, figure time to do a vid, you know. So uh, got a little, little background music in the back. Hopefully you can hear it. Turn it down a little bit. But anyway, I got this uh, Silver Thunder 40. Uh, came from up there where they make them good uh, cheese steaks. You know what that is. Anyway, got one left. Silver Thunder 40. Uh, let's see what kind of crack this thing has here. Not bad. Ring detached. Smells like your generic funky hot liquor. Nothing extra special. I'm trying to compare it to something. That I don't know. Maybe a cross between. Maybe like High Life, High Life, and uh, like a skunked old English or something. It's uh, not very good. I didn't expect that it would be, but just add it to the collection. So anyway, I have. Something I want to talk about today is kind of pissing me off. I got a letter in the mail last week. I got my damn address covered up. See, other crazy fuckers don't know where I live. But if you can see that, it's from the damn Census Bureau. All right? All right. So I open it up. And it says, Dear Resident, about a week from now, you receive a 2010 census form in the mail. When you receive your form, please fill it out and mail it in properly. And it's uh, got some other bullshit that it's saying, signed by somebody, and it's written in about five or six other languages at the bottom. So I thought about it, you know, I'm like, you know, that's kind of strange. I mean, it's not strange for our government, but send a... Uh, a fucking letter telling me that they're gonna send a letter right so a few days ago we got the census uh, questionnaire in the mail so my wife and I fill it out carefully answering each question um, I wouldn't want to fuck up that survey. And, um, got it ready to mail out. I didn't email the motherfucker. It's still in the damn, um, under the visor in the truck. So, uh, that's where it still is. So, uh, I hadn't mailed it yet. And I was going to bring it in here for a prop to show you, but, you know, when I got the idea, it was late. And I'm not going outside to show you something fucking envelope but you already know what it is anyway so anyway well, I'll eventually will mail that but that, that's besides the point yesterday I got the mail and I got this I got another fucking postcard this time from the damn census this one saying a few days ago you should have received a request to participate in the 2010 census <coughs> It was sent to your address as part of our effort to conduct the most accurate census possible. It is important that you respond. If you've already provided your census information, please accept our sincere thanks. Blah, 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 bullshit, bullshit. Well, you know, the government is already in debt for like, what, trillions of dollars or some shit. So, I was adding it up, and uh, 
I got one of these little cheap calculators. It doesn't go but so high. But a stamp is like 40 some cents. Well, let's say they group mass mail these things. So let's say, let's say 30 cents, they, you know, average, cost 30 cents an envelope. And there's roughly 115 million families in the United States. So if I say 1 million, and multiply that times 30 cents. That's $300,000 per 1000000 families for uh, for one envelope, right? So if you multiply that times 115, there's going to be 115 million families. One set of envelopes cost over $34 million. To mail that shit out. Now they sent three envelopes. So you multiply 34,500,000 times three, and that's a big fucking number. That's like a hundred, over a hundred, uh, it's over a hundred million dollars on fucking postage for the census. A hundred million dollars. Now I could think of a lot of things to spend a hundred million hundred million dollars on it. And it wouldn't be some fucking postage stamps. So I'm just kind of pissed, you know. I mean, I know our government pisses money away left and right. But I mean, come on. A hundred million dollars in fucking postage for some damn census shit that don't, you know, I know it has a purpose, but damn, man, take that money and give it to give it to people that need it. You know, instead of sending that and doing all this bullshit, pass the you know, spread the damn wealth out a little bit. I tell you this, Silver Thunder is kind of sweet. I mean, almost like. They took a regular malt and just dumped extra sugar in it. Um, it's not out of date. It goes out of date April 5th. So it's still in date, but it's uh, real fucking sugary. I wouldn't recommend this. It's uh, way too sweet. It's kind of got a funky, kind of got a funky aftertaste, which goes along with a fucked up funky smell. Um, definitely wouldn't buy it. Of course, I can't buy it around here. I had my brother-in-law uh, pick it up for me when he went up north, among some other things. Is good for a belch, I guess. It says Silver Thunder 40 Malt Liquor. Brewed with classic natural ingredients for smooth, full flavor. It should say brewed with old, fucked up, funky ingredients for a shitty taste because it tastes like shit. Look at the damn suds in that shit. All them fucking suds. If y'all wonder where this playing, you know what the intro was. A little bit of Shabba Ranks and a couple tracks from Big Mike circa about 1992, 93, something like that. Back when I had my store some of the shit that I sold. Ain't bad. I know y'all get tired of hearing fucking Slender Skinner and Pink Void, so I figured I'd break it up for you. Let me go on and finish this bitch.
nigga like me cause you ain't got no patience Think I'm rolling dentons, I made the even elbows The only way I roll them if I catch them on sale, bro huh. I'm like this, trying to get my hustle I'm not drinking the rest of that fucking phone. It was like somebody washed their clothes in that bottle with all that fucking suds. Shit. But there it is. Silver Thunder 40. Shitty malt liquor. Don't fucking buy it. Don't recommend it at all. Um, make sure you fill out your census form. Since the government's done spent a hundred fucking million dollars on postage, the least you can do is fill the motherfucker out. 